when people would ask me, what is it that you want to do? Or what are some of the opportunities that you want to have for yourself? I would respond with, I just want to be comfortable. I just want to be comfortable. Now I ask myself, what the hell was I thinking about when I responded with that kind of statement? I just want to be comfortable. What was going on in my mind during that time? And if you're saying that to yourself, I just want to be comfortable or I'm comfortable, let's discuss what is probably going on in your mind because I can tell you what was probably going on in mind at that time. Typically, when the statement of I want to be comfortable means that you have mentally given up. You have mentally stopped wanting to fight for something better or the next level because comfortable means stable, stability. It means I don't have to do anything extra. It actually means I'm just okay with being average. And I just can't believe that I said that to someone that all I want to be is comfortable because I hate average people. I was going to be okay with being average. So when people say, or when I said it, all I want to be is comfortable. I was just wanting to be a nobody. I didn't want to push myself. I didn't want to take myself to the next level. I was okay with uh, mediocre relationships with people that did not push me to be better. So I want to say this to you real quick. If you're saying that you're okay with being comfortable, you're okay with being in your comfort zone, because again, that's what I was saying, right? Then it's time to reevaluate. Let's think about how we can step outside of that comfort zone that we have put ourselves in. What can we do to push ourselves? Now, I'm not going to say I need to just push you over the cliff. That's not what I do. That's not how I talk to you. You know that. I'm about what can we do to put our foot outside that comfort zone. And then once you put one foot out, then we can put the other foot out. And then once we are outside of that little circle that we've created for ourselves, that comfortable zone, then we can move out past that and maybe create another zone for ourselves that we can so-called call ourselves comfortable. And then we can push ourselves out there. Guys, I know that this is a... It's a stepping stone and sometimes moving outside of your comfort zone or your comfortable zone can be very stressful. And I know that's the reason why I responded to that person with that quote that I just want to be comfortable because I was tired that I knew that being outside of that comfort zone meant that I had to do more work, that I would have to, you know, probably even talk to more people, <laughs> but being in that zone does not put me in a, well, take me to the next level. And that's what I really want. I have so many goals and aspirations for myself and my relationship with my husband. And I cannot make those things happen if I am comfortable. So if you're saying that to yourself, let today be the day that you stick your toe outside of the comfort zone. All right. All right, guys, this is Elise Michelle, your online marketing and branding coach. And I want to say you guys have a great and awesome day, my superstars. And I'll be talking to you later. Peace out.